I set a personal goal for myself in July to just uh, try to become more mindful and um, spend some time, you know, really being present in the moment. And I want to share a story with you. So the other day I was at the Dollar General um, getting some things for 4th of July and there were a couple little boys in front of me and they were using their chime card, you know, those little preloadable cards and buying some chips or toys or something like that. And um, they were short, 37 cents. And the cashier said she just said, you know, the card was declined. She's sorry. She she couldn't um, let them go through with the purchase because they were short 37 cents and they didn't have any cash on them. So I pulled out a dollar and I was like, I got it. And uh, she was like, oh, thank you. I, you know, if I do that all the time, it comes out of my paycheck. And I was like, I understand. It's fine. It's, it's no, no worries. It's 37 cents. Um, and, uh, one of the little boys, the older little boy, whispered into the, the younger little boy's ear, and he looked at me and he said, thank you. And I said, of course, you're welcome. And, um, and the, in that situation, thinking about it, uh, it, it could have been that they were disappointed that they couldn't get their bag of chips and their little dollar toy. Um, but they were able to, and I think making that situation come from a possibly uncomfortable situation for them to a situation that was at ease um, because I was just more aware. I was just um, more aware of my surroundings and, um, and could help, and so I did. And it's not that... Um, it's really anything that doesn't happen every single day to people. I've been that person too, that my card was declined or I was short or I forgot my wallet and, you know, someone behind me just kind of sat there and said, oh, too bad. <laughs> oh, well, um, you know, but um, just having just having that uh, moment with those little boys and when he looked into my eyes and said, thank you, that just, um, that made my heart happy. <laughs> So um, my goal for myself is just to become more present in the moment, to become more aware of my surroundings, to kind of take in um, the little things uh, I've noticed since I've been doing this and working on meditating and things like that, that I'm more aware of my surroundings. And I love gardening, and if you've ever been to my house and you notice all the one million mini chaos gardens that I have all over the place. Um, there's just lots of wildlife and animals, frogs, and butterflies and dragonflies and hummingbirds and uh, lizards all over the place. And I've just taken more notice to them and how beautiful they are and um, how I love gardening so much. It helps me be peaceful and in the moment. And I love watching things grow. And so I want to also grow within myself as well. And um, working out in the yard is, is one way that really helps me do that. Um, I told someone one time that uh, gardening was my therapy um, or a form of therapy for me. And uh, they knew what my, my house uh, gardens looked like. And they were like, oh, you must have a lot to work on. <laughs> I was like, yes, yes, I do. <laughs> um, but uh, it's it's a good thing. Um, so just trying to, you know, embrace and and notice and enjoy uh, that present moment. Um, turning twenty times two has been uh, kind of eye opening because you think about all the things that have happened in all of those years and. And the time that's gone by and so I think for me it's not just about um, reflecting on the past but being um, grateful for where the past has brought me to this point in this day in this moment and that's what fills my heart with gratitude for this summer for the situations um, 
whether difficult or not, um, where I am to be grateful and joyful and um, have gratitude for all of those things and my friends and my family and my loved ones and the health and well-being of um, those that I love. And uh, so that's really where I'm at. And I just wanted to share that little story with you. If uh, you notice that someone needs help today, even if it's just one tiny little act of kindness, even if it's just 37 cents, it might be something that they remember for a long time. And it might be something that they can carry with them to also pass forward to the next person as well. And uh, I know it sounds cheesy, but we all could use a, a little more kindness in this world. And, um, and uh, a little bit goes a really long way. All my best. Namaste.